Hello everyone and welcome back on my channel today with a follow-up on the unboxing on Estee Lauder products. Mainly, I will talk a little bit about this here. And this is a foundation. The shade I'm using is 2N1 or Desert Beige. And the foundation is pretty new, it's their new product. And it's a water something base product. Uh, it says Futurist Hydra Rescue. So even Hydra, that means water, it's based of, on water hydration. And it's a SPF 45. I love this foundation. I don't really like foundations. I don't really apply all the time foundations, but I think I'm going to use this as much as I can. Number one is because it has SPF 45 and it protects my skin. And number two is because it doesn't give me any rashes. It covers really well. It's light on my skin. I'm only using one pump because I don't like too much. You can use two pumps if you want to. That's up to you. It's everybody, everybody's skin is different. Uh, I'm always using it in combination with, where is it? I don't find it right now. It's the primer. Also the Estee Lauder primer that I got to test it out as well. It's also a pretty decent size uh, sample. It comes in 0.5 flare ounces hope it focuses well let's see uh, let's go this way yeah well doesn't work out as much as I want to anyways this I'm applying it with my fingertips not too much less is more like I always say and it works really good with the foundation now on top of it sometimes i put a little bit of powder and it's the double wear powder from estee lauder also in two two n one or dazed beige what i like about this powder is very light and fine on the skin it no it doesn't it does give you a natural look and the applicator has a separate compartment which i also like a lot um, i've been also testing the bronzer which i put a little bit on I'm not sure if you can see it but um it, it is noticeable and this comes in bronze goddess powder bronzer or two medium it looks like this and I'm applying it with a blender brush as well because this brush doesn't do too much. As far as the highlighter, which I also got to test it out, it was actually on sale. It's 003 Bronze Goddess. I also applied it, not sure if you see, but I can see and I can feel it it is a really light really nice um, highlighter i always apply it with my fingertips it works better than with the brush at least for me and that's how it looks like okay and next but last but not least the pencil the lip pencil which is number eight or spice which is really creamy. It works good with the lipstick or even without lipstick. I even put a gloss on right now so you can see what the color is on my, um, on my lips. I used this kind of gloss. But this is mainly the color of the, uh, actually the, the pencil, the lip pencil. I like natural colors. I like to look natural. So that's why I'm purchasing this kind of products and they work really good for me the eyeliner i'm not too excited about um it's not too easy to work with it takes a while for it to you know go on all the corners but it's good and it it doesn't smear it lasts really good in the heat 
so this was the pretty much testing of the Estee Lauder products again I am very excited about this futurist foundation it's new it's good at least it works very good for me so if you live in the very sunny areas where you have to stay in the sun or have more contact with the sun I think it's perfect with the 45 SPF and I, I didn't see anything higher than 45 SPF so I'm gonna keep using it and keep rebuying it I also like the double wear which I don't have here right now but I kind of know how this works out double wear I'm gonna use mainly for the cooler weather it's also a nice uh, foundation so this was as the louder uh, follow-up thank you very much for watching till next time